<laughs> Nick Hulkins outside the London Stadium with Tom. Tom, that was a horror show, mate. Absolute, mate. I mean, the first sort of 40 minutes, I mean, I, I left on 41, I think, minutes ago, get a beer half time. And then I, it's too, too. I mean, I mean, what do you do? I mean, you, you got the old cheek of sort of pay it, sort of rebone where it is, and the old assist on the second I mean, goal. Let's be fair, Tom. We started fantastically. For 40 minutes, we was unbelievable. And exactly. I mean, I mean, how much money would you got if you put on like your house, like you put, you put your money on like two, two half time? I mean, it must have been 100 to one. Uh, it's must ridiculous, have been ridiculous one. price, mate. I mean, that is the West Ham. Though. I mean, and, and you can't go concede. No offence to Watford, they are the, they're like the sort of least sort of like the lowest sort of, of the London clubs. If they've gone and score four goals against today, mate. What the fucking hell are Arsenal and, and Chelsea going to do at home to us? Tottenham won 4 0 at Stoke. Exactly. Honestly, we're going to get obliterated, mate. We're, and you know, that's nine goals conceded in our first four games. I know four of them here today, but it's honestly fucking. What the fuck's Billy's leaving fucking Ogbon on the bench? What's that all about? If he hasn't got a fucking knock, I want to know why the fuck he ain't playing today. Because Ogbonner is our best centre back. I'm, I'm not afraid to meet it. Bono is the best fucking centre back. I mean, Ginger got fucking torn to pieces today. Torn to pieces today. And I, and I said this, maybe. I, I, I admit, I'm, I thought. Maybe Jin's like today with Ogbonna, you know, but not Ogbonna and fucking Reed. I'm sorry. I, I, I want to know what, what, I mean, if Og, uh, fair enough, if, if Ogbonna's got a fucking knock, mate, fair enough. I, I totally, I take, I take him to Chin. You play your best, they are our best two centre backs, but you throw Oxford into the mix, you throw other things into the mix, you know. I, I don't, I want to know what Oxford, I, I, I think Ogbonna's on the bench, really. I mean, so he's not injured, so for me, it's total, but it's just the day lost of the game, because we're turning up playing fantastic, but. That second goal of theirs, I mean, as I said, I missed it, but I watched it and with Troy Deeney sort of dinked over the goalie. Good goal. And it was like a mix-up between Adrian and Ginge. I mean, what the hell is he Well, let's, uh, let's talk about him as well, because I thought he was at for three of the goals today, Adrian. Does he need to be dropped by next week? I, I've said this before, mate. For me personally, a goalie is our one, number one position. We've got two OK goalies, you know, and um, I don't want to say it. I honestly wanted Hart to come here because the thing is, our Hart's a bit much better goalkeeper. That's, that's my own personal opinion. But today, yeah, he's had a bit of a mirror. I mean, to concede four goals at home, especially against Watford, no disrespect to Watford, they've come here today. Two went through his body, mate. Yeah. He, he got mixed up with one. You know what I mean? I, I just don't know, mate. It come out, you know, it's fair enough, 2-2, two, two, level playing field, second half. But did we actually have a shot on target, second half? No, mate, no. I, don't, I can't I, I'm remember. Being, I'm being deadly no, serious. No, I can't remember. And that's, and that's with our attacking flair of Payet and Lanzini. I'll tell you what, mate, we've got major fucking issues this year. I'll tell you, if that's what we've got to go on this year, we've got major issues. But hey, it's okay. The 30 billionaires, or Baroness Brady, is saying about this morning about, oh, we've got the 30 Chinese billionaires that want to come into the Premier League. Well, if that's what they've got to spend the money on, well, good luck with that, mate. I mean, I, I wouldn't be spending any money on that. Have we, listen, before I move on, Tom, this is the last bit. If we got rid of too many players with Premier League experience and bought in too many risks. You could say that. I mean, he's substitutions today. He bought Caleri on. Um, obviously, I mean, yeah, he's done very... He's done OK. Caleri, he hasn't, he, he hasn't scored. Um, who else did he bring on? I mean, he brought on Fletcher. I mean, Fletcher's... I, I like Fletcher, but he's, as you said, he's an Not really, is he? Yeah, two, two of the substitutions. You're totally right, Nicky. Two of the substitutions he's brought on the day, and yet again, he's down the village. I mean, but for me, personally, Ogbonna was the main reason the day. Ogbonna was the main reason. Not having Bogle on the pitch. It's, it's a total... Unless he's got an injury, I, I, we don't know, but... I just can't believe he's dropped Ogbonna today. Mm -hmm. I mean, Ogbonna would not make the mistakes that Jin's made today. Yeah, all change next week. All change next week. I mean, I mean, you looked at that before today. You looked at the six next six games. You, you'd say. I, I think the gut loving thing is today, Tom. Is I think this this was a chance to really get our season going. We've had two tough yeah. away games. We had a scrappy one there against Nick, Bournemouth with no players. Sitting, Nick, I think we're one of the worst conceded amount of goals in the Premier. We're sitting in the bottom three tonight. Are we in trouble? Going, Are we in trouble? Be honest. I don't want to say we're in trouble, mate. But the thing is. <laughs> It's hard to say, you know. I mean, everyone's looking down tonight. We've just been beat by Watford, and they can, and they score four goals against us. How can you not be down B again? There's nothing to take positive out of that game. Yeah, all right, fair enough. Pyatt scored, a, he scored two assists, and he's got a fantastic Rabona for the second goal. But apart from that, it's absolute shower shit, mate. Absolute shower shit. I mean, that's it. All right, Tom. Thanks, mate. I'll see you next week. Cheers, mate.